You know, normally we're talking about tools that you can use to take care of your motorcycle. But what do you have around the shop to take care of you while you're working on the motorcycle? That's what we're going to talk about today on Cruise Man's Cool Tools. There are a few simple things you should have in every workshop, garage, just to make sure you're taking care of yourself while you're working on your bike. Now, the first and most obvious one are some of these Natril gloves, and I wear these every time I'm changing fluids, like if I'm changing coolant or oil or final drive fluids, especially if you're using something like a brake cleaner or a carburetor cleaner, something that's a really harsh chemical. It's just never a good idea to get these chemicals on your skin, and of course, if you do, you want to wash it off right away. So these are a really inexpensive item. You just throw them away when you're done and you can get them at Walmart or just about anywhere. I'll put a link down below if you want to get them from Amazon. Uh, I think I got these at Costco, but there's a lot of different places you can get these. Now, the next thing is you don't want to get any of these chemicals in your eyes. That's very important. So I highly recommend that you have a good pair of protective eyewear to wear as you're working on the bike. Now, if you wear glasses, um, they do make some that will fit over your glasses, but you'd want to make sure to prevent something like something splashing in your eye, or if you're working on a grinder or something like that, you don't want a piece of metal to get in your eye for sure. That's not good. So make sure you have protective eyewear. Now, if you're working on something like, let's say you're loosening or tightening bolts in a real tight area, and if that ratchet slips, you could really cut your hand or you know, bang your hand up pretty bad. It's always a good idea to have a set of these work gloves. Uh, they come in all different colors, different weights. They're basically mechanics gloves. They're very inexpensive. Again, I'll put a link down below where you can find these. Now, the last thing I'm going to talk about is kind of taking care of your knees and your joints. Uh, you get up and down a lot, like if you're changing oil or changing a tire, you may have to get down on your knees. I use one of these pads uh, every time I have to get down on the ground, and it has really saved my knees because sometimes you have to get down on one knee to do something. And this offers a lot of padding and a lot of protection. And if you have to lay down to do something on the bike, like put the rear wheel back on, you can also put it under your hips. It's just a great little tool, not expensive at all, and really helps to kind of save a lot of pain in the future. So. Take care of yourself while you're working on your bike and you're going to be able to ride more and that's what it's all about. Now, if you like this video, please take a second to click that little subscribe button down below. And if you click on the little bell icon, YouTube will notify you when we come out with another Cool Tools video. Thanks again for watching today on Cruise Man's Garage.